Be muscular is cool. It's obvious that everybody wants to look good, but it's hard to take the first steps, I know. So I'm gonna show you guys today 10 things you need to do before starting your fitness journey. Number eight, get the proper outfit and shoes to train. Well, there's nothing more embarrassing than seeing newbies at the gym without the proper outfit. Flip-flops are for the beach. So forget this when you go training. There's so many people that wear this while training. Well, it's not for me and it's not for you either if you want to start a serious fitness journey. So get rid of this. This is what you need, proper gym shoes. They need to be comfortable, they need to be stretchy, they need to be ventilated, and this is what you need to train. It's not just about the brand or how much they cost or if they look good or if they're trendy. They actually need to make sure that you train with the best possible posture and balance. Balance is vital when you train. So if you have a flat fit and then it keeps your knee in position, everything else would follow, you know, with your back and your shoulders and everything else, it's important as well to avoid any injuries. So yeah, get out there, get to the shop, get some shoes, of course, get two if you can, it's kind of better. As any discipline, it requires a proper outfit. So let's say, first thing, a stringer. It needs to actually fit you. It needs to have the proper fabric, it needs to be ventilated, it doesn't make you sweat, it actually keeps you tight as well at the same time, it doesn't go against the weights or in the way when you do an exercise. So this really fits my physique because it's really stretchy but at the same time it's useful and practical. So it's not just about the stringers but you know I would advise you to as well get a hoodie or a jumper or something warmer. I always use this when I warm up because of course I warm up faster, so it keeps my muscle warmer and then I'm ready for my workout. And at the same time I use it when I leave the gym because of course your heart rate kind of increases when you're training, you're sweaty, so you need to actually look after your body because that's what you're working for. So be smart and don't catch a cold. Number nine, you need to buy a proper gym bag. This is of vital importance, but then again, it's actually more important what you put in your gym bag. If you wanna get muscular, you need to be serious about this. I see a lot of people that try to save themselves to carry heavy stuff all day around, but guys, I got bad news for you. If you wanna be muscular, you need to be ready for the daily packing. Yes. You need to be systematic in everything that you do every single day. You need to have your food, you need to have your proper gym clothes, you need to have your supplements. You need to actually be safe even when you're not at home to actually make sure that you stick to the plan to reach your goals. So let me go through uh, what I have on my gym bag today. So to show you guys what you should pack if you want to start to get serious about your fitness journey. Gym shoes, pre-workout, wrist straps, gym gloves, towel, my wireless headphones, my shaker with a powder rack at the end, underwear and socks, my training stringer, my BCAA, grip pads, my protein, protein bars as a snack, my food with cutlery, my belt, shower gel, pill box. You see, this is actually what you need to pack in your gym bag. So make sure you have a big and comfortable gym bag because you need to carry this every single day. It needs to cover your diet, it needs to cover your training, it needs to cover your supplementations. And these are, these are the three most important thing if you wanna get muscular and you wanna achieve your goals. So remember, this is all you need. This is all your life, it's a lifestyle. You chose to do this, this is your life. Number 10, educate yourself. Bodybuilding is your new world, right? You're interested in it. So educate yourself, study. When you don't know anything about something, what do you do? You study, you ask people, you read magazines, you read websites, you ask anything. If you go to your gym, of course, everybody's more talented than you because even if someone is there for one more day, right? 
So of course you can always get some tips out to you, some advice is there really, really important when you start out. Always be kind of careful when you read stuff. I want you to be critical about that. If it doesn't work for you, it's not worth trying it, right? So it's good to try out new things, as I said, but if I'm really like a world champion diet, how can it fit to you? You know, you just start it out, your metabolism is quite different, you know, your, your body is different. You cannot just go through like a hell training from a Mr. Olympia or a you know, huge guy because you don't have the skills, you don't have the body to do that and you just risk to get injured at the same time. I always recommend you guys, you know, you know, to subscribe to the Biotech USA YouTube channel because of course, you know, it's me and other guys, they are so passionate about the sport but they are experts at the same time. You know, I graduated in nutrition, I went to university because I was so passionate about this. You actually find new ways to know stuff. So in the beginning, maybe you know a little things. Yeah, training, okay, I move some weights. But then, how do you move the weights? What are the angles of working? What are the different intensity techniques? You know, the drop sets, the negatives, the uh, super sets, giant sets, monster sets. What, 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 what is it all of this? Right? What is it all of this about? So subscribe to the channel, you know, see all the videos, try stuff on you, start to learn how your body works and you realize that maybe a couple of years down the line, you actually know perfectly what's good and what's not good for your body. So educate yourself, study, be serious about what you're doing and good luck for it. We're at the end of our, you know, 10 most useful things that you can do when you start your fitness journey, but education without action does nothing. So make sure you actually pack your bag now and let's go to the gym. Remember to subscribe as well to the Biotech USA channel on YouTube because of course I told you we're always uploading new videos about all of the fitness world. So if you wanna keep updated with everything related to nutrition, training and supplementation, which are the most important things for you right now. Subscribe and watch the videos. But not now, because I know you need to train. So watch it later.